Hey there everybody, Jimmy with To The Top Crane here. And today we are working on a gas turbine generator. So this is uh, basically a jet engine in a box connected to a uh, electrical generator. This piece in front of us is the air intake ductwork. So this big box to my right, or kind of, kind of to my right, is the air intake. And then what they're working on is. Uh, a section of the ductwork that contains a bunch of baffles and what those baffles do I think is uh, attenuate the sound and they're, we're replacing that section so I got a couple guys up top that are uh, doing some rigging getting me hooked up to it it's kind of some tricky rigging because the top of that duct is sloped. got to come straight up out of there so there's two flanges one on each side that it, that it bolts to sorry for the pauses I'm trying to pay attention to what they're doing and think of what to say next but so there's two flanges that uh, bolt up on each side and this piece has to fit in between all of that so for it to come out it's got to come straight up and then it'll be even trickier when we put the new one in but the new one is in two halves sitting behind us on the ground. Okay, so they're pulling one of the flanges back away from the piece I'm picking. And this piece is going to, I'm, I was told initially to plan for 50,000, but there's no way this thing weighs 50,000. The new one's about 14 or so without any baffles in it. And I was told the baffles weigh around six, so I'm guessing we're going to have about twenty-three thousand total. Uh, I've got my second light or my second witch reeved also, so we've got our ball hanging out up top. You'll see what that's for later in the video. I have to two line some stuff, but anyway, right now we're going after this first piece to get it out of the way. That's the way we're configured. We've got 115 feet of main boom out, so that's all five sections at 46%. Sitting on full span outriggers on my big mats, got 110,000 pounds of counterweight hanging on the back. Main, main lines reefed with four parts of line into the block. Whip lines got one part onto the ball or the bill, and it is all the way up there for right now. And once we pull this piece out, I'm gonna swing it around to my right and set it down on the ground. And then we will start building the new one to go, that goes back in. And then I have to set them pretty close to each other so we can transfer the baffles from one to the other. And then we will, uh, set it and set the new one in place. Sounds easy, but I guess this is about a four or five day project, maybe six. So anyway, they're still taking some bolts out, make sure everything's the way they want it. When we get ready to fly this thing out of here, I'll turn this back on. Okay, so we're coming up on it easy. Dump these 
stop me for a second. Let's make cable down. I mean, what we would like to have is this piece just come straight up. I don't know how well that's going to work out, but we shall soon see. Coming up easy. each other they'll bolt them together then we'll pick the whole thing up turn it orient the top towards me and then uh, we'll stand the whole thing up vertical got to turn my camera on so we're standing this piece up and then it's got a bunch of pieces that go inside of it Shove some pins through it, get the holes lined up, clamp it in place, shove some bolts in it, and then I'm sure they'll cut me loose. <laughs> 